Hello, in this video I will tell you about our plugin for Revit. It's called HVACR.cloud and it allows to uh, calculate um, conditioning systems. Um, here are the menu. Uh, you see that you can calculate where F systems and Chile Fun Call uh, conditioning systems. Um, also, this plugin allows you to uh, insert uh, all the condition equipment uh, into the project in Revit. Uh, so, let's see uh, the, menu, the menu. Uh, here comes the equipment menu, and you see that uh, you uh, can insert the uh, brand joints for VRF systems, the indoor units and the outdoor units. Uh, for chiller fan coil systems, uh, you can insert valves, uh, fan coils, chillers, uh, and you also see the calculate system buttons. Uh, the calculate system button for VRF systems, uh, it uh, calculates the system, so it uh, <coughs> makes them uh, sizing, uh, and it also automatically chooses the uh, brain joints. And for the uh, chiller fan call system, it um, here you can see two buttons. Uh, the first one calculates the sizes, and the uh, second one uh, makes the balancing. Uh, so let's try all this. Uh, let's go to uh, this uh, view. Here so you see the VRF system. Uh, here we have a chiller fan call system, uh, and here is uh, all the uh, system of our project. Uh, so uh, let's insert the equipment. First of all, let's um, start with, for example, indoor unit. Uh, you see, you here you uh, choose the manufacturer and uh, you uh, choose the type of units. Uh, and here you can choose the uh, unit, for example, for a cassette unit, uh, and you choose the series and uh, input the parameters and push the calculate button. Here's the result of the uh, calculation, and then this expert button uh, exports your unit to Revit. So now the unit is uh, inserted into the project. I push the escape button and I see my uh, indoor unit. Here's uh, the one. Uh, let's now insert the outdoor unit. We also choose the uh, series, uh, input the parameters and push the calculate button. So here it's calculated and the expert button inserts it into the project. So here it is. Uh, now let's do the same for uh, chiller fan coil systems. Uh, so we uh, choose it here, equipment, uh, fan coils is the same, um, it looks the same as for VRF systems and so let, let us uh, insert a chiller. So I again uh, choose the type of chillers uh, and <coughs> here, okay, let it be like this and we push the calculate button, we see the technical data and we uh, push the export button. So here is our chiller. As you see, the uh, whole project uh, is made um, with the equipment uh, exported from our plugin, uh, both for chiller fan call systems and for VIF systems. Uh, now let's uh, calculate uh, the systems. Uh, for example, this VIF system, we uh, just choose uh, the system, uh, then we <coughs> choose the, our plugin, uh, and for the VRF system we push the calculate system button. So the <coughs> system is calculated, uh, we can see this RefNet for example, uh, and uh, it has changed its model. Uh, so um, the system, our plugin, uh, it put a different ref, um, brand join. So now let's calculate uh, chiller fan call system, uh, we again choose uh, the system, then push the uh, calculate system button and push the calculate sizes button. Uh, here we input the parameters and uh, push the OK button uh, so the calculation gets started. So as you see the pipe sizes uh, have been changed automatically uh, and we can also uh, choose a control valve, for instance this one, and uh, you see uh, here the regulator setting uh, and the uh, pressure loss. So thank you for watching.